making Ash Ketchum. Let me start, start some tunes. If I could forget just what we had, spend all of my days outside my head without all these feelings. We there we go, that's some music. Let's get into it. I went ahead already and started on the base for um, the shirt, as you have the reference image down here. So yeah. Uh, bu -bu. There we go. That's easier for me. Uh, what shall we start on? Let's start with... yeah, I already started on the vest. So let's finish that up first. I am gonna go for a closed look because, well, I'm kinda lazy and I think it will look nice. Mm, so we want short sleeves. It's gonna be around here somewhere. Oh, come on. Let me draw. Oh, yeah. Can't draw a lot with an eraser with an eraser, now can you? Off to a great start already. So somewhere around there. Okay. It was somewhere around... Yeah. Somewhere around there, let's go for the 75 mark. So I know on the other side I have to use a 25 mark to have a symmetrical look. Then on the top, because we don't want to clip off too much. Like so. And then we can clip out those corners. The only disadvantage is that our sleeves will now be open, so we will actually have to use some arm texture. Mm. Yeah. Let's remove the background. Make sure that we don't remove too much. Let's see. Let's see? Like stuff like that, we don't want to remove that. Here as well, like so. Mm. Yeah, just something like this should suffice. And hit delete. There we go. Far cleaner. And I know this tends to delete some over there as well. So let's unselect those parts. It's not like this is necessary, but I just think it leaves a cleaner finish, unlike the texture itself. There we go. That's gonna be our base. Let's save this. And save as our vest. Yes. And let's see what Viewright Studio makes out of it. Yeah, that seems okay as a base. So, what do we need to do? We need to change the color of the body, add pockets, add a button, and make sure that the color stays white. Sounds easy enough. To do so, we shall start 
by separating the body as a layer via cut. Which is gonna be body. And then this is gonna be color and sleeves. For the body, we want to make sure that it is absolutely white because that's easier to work with when applying other colors. I found out that the easiest way to do this is to first set a U and go for absolutely white, like completely colorless. Body decoloring, same for the sleeves. Uh, let me quickly do something. Okay, um, uh, Paul. Layer style based. Okay, now we want to duplicate this layer and call it body blue. Because we will be making it blue. Now let's see what blue it is exactly. It's a rather vibrant blue. Let's see. Something like this blue should be fine. Oh. And it's actually a nice yellow for the pockets. This seems about right. Yeah. Damn. This might be going quicker than I imagined. Um, hmm. Okay. <laughs> I mean, let's save this. Just as a quick preview. Yes, okay. Imports. Yeah, I can already see some resemblance. I mean, it's not perfect by any means, but there's a resemblance. Actually, I could easily enough split it open, couldn't I? Yeah. Never mind my previous blabbering. One here and one here. I'm gonna cut it though because, well, oh shit, it's from the body layer via cut, body center. I don't want it like that, do I? I need part of the body center. I need like the... some chunky part out of it. I'll say... something like this. 
which is going to be like the connecting part. Button patch? I don't know how to call it. I'm just making up words at this point. I should be able to just do this and this. And that's the power of some decent Photoshop. And if we then check this out, I hope it looks somewhat decent-ish. Is my audio actually audible this time? Yeah, okay. So no three hour stream with me not being audible for two hours of it. Totally not happened. That totally did not happen on the stream that I did not upload to YouTube. <coughs> uh, okay, that's... I can work with this. I'm not gonna deny that this does look a bit weird, but you know what? The eraser wants to get selected. Come on, where? I hate it when it doesn't display the eraser on this. Come on, I just need that part. Yeah, never mind. Whoa, I've been pushing a lot of buttons. Yeah, it's easier to just import it again. Okay, so I want to erase the center for equal width. And then on the inside, I don't, I'm not really sure what it, what it actually is removing. What actually changed? Like, wait, I think I see it, but I'm not entirely sure. Like, I think. This. So if I remove this and this, oh, is that about right? Not even close. I wish I could like. Mm. How is this the part? This more or less is what I need. But I want it to be a cleaner cut than this. Because this is this is messy. But from what I can gather. Cutting no, this is the backside, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, okay, that makes it easy enough. So that means it's 
not that. But this. That looks promising. This, because that's going to be the connecting part between the two sides. And the same for the other side. Right? Uh, 3D thinking. Yeah, that actually looks pretty clean. Aside from that I deleted... Wait, let's see, where, where are those parts? Come on. I don't need those removed. Oh wow, this is gonna be some... Almost like... Oof, 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 oof. It's gonna be anything but simple. What's what? I have a brush selected. Shit. Okay, so basically the two outer spikes. But I do wanna know what. Oh! Wrong button. Okay. So in theory that means that I need to remove... Let's see... from these selections. No, wait, that's not correct. From this, I subtract this, and I subtract that, and then... Nope. How am I gonna do this? Contiguous, yes. I select all of this, combined with some more stuffs. Tolerance, let's say 10. Tiny bit more. Something like this, sure. Steer clear from those. Uh, and then subtract those. That's what I want to do. And then if I do this. Shit, what is it part of? This should be it. Save as. PNG. Fest. Save. Yes. Okay. Question mark? Well. It's already part of it. But I removed too much. Ah, oh, damn it! It's only the darkest part that I have to delete. Wait, but I only did delete the dark. <sighs> the 
it seems like a flat line. Bam. Somewhere around there. Bam, bam, bam. Oh, well, it worked out. I misclicked, but it worked out. Temp numero dos. Actually, I have no idea what I deleted now. Uh, okay, so I still need to delete this. So, oh wait, what? No, that's the back. I don't need to delete anything from the back. But it looks like I basically need to delete like the top curve. This might different color. That might help. Aha. Let's see what deleting that would change. That would change absolutely nothing. So the only thing I need to delete are like the tips in those corners. And it looks like where the white ends to the top. Okay. So, where the white ends. To the top. Oh. And same for this side. Which is gonna be something like this. One day I'll just have like the entire um, UV, I believe it's called the UV, layer just memorized. Like, oh, you need that pixel removed? Yeah, you have to remove that one on the, uh, on the model. Well, that's, that's, that's partially it. I need to flatten it off, it seems. Or is it, wait, what? Oh! Huh? I thought I... Oh, okay. Even easier. But I think uh, up to the dark gray, right? And now I've done it. Yeah, up to the dark gray. Okay. hope this is fine because I don't think I can go back enough. <laughs>
the hell? Why is there so much to delete? Hmm, a bit less. Wait, what? You know what, instead of constantly guesstimating, it's probably easier for me to just export. Oh! Hey Vrar, thanks for the follow! I hope you're gonna pop up by, feel free to say something in chat. Ah, there you go. So, do you also want to learn how to make Ash Ketchum? Or are you just here because... Because me. <laughs> See, like I'm, I'm massive. I'm big time confused oh, as to why this doesn't work the way it should. Like everything I delete, it's like delete more, delete more. Uh. Actually, I was confused. Perhaps not the greatest idea to free slots. Uh, me and Virus Studio do not get along, so anyone that makes stuff in it is like, wow. Legendary. To be fair, Virus Studio is easy enough once you like have some decent software to use. And of course, you have to like know where what goes. <laughs> What's the game again? I know there's this one game with like a very base legendary, but except no voice cracks. <clears throat> I think you got some artistic ability. Well, thanks. I do not consider myself artistic in any way, shape or form. But that's probably because I have a lot of friends who actually like studied arts. Finish him! I th yeah, that might be the one that I was thinking of. Fatality! Just keep having to delete stuff. I just should have went for a close check. <laughs> it would have been way easier. Uh, but I think once I've deleted that, I have it all. I d I I'm looking up the legendary. But I. Uh, ah! The room is quiet. Nope. I was disappointed. Eh, yeah, whatever. 
we'll figure it out one day or not. Who knows? Uh, bo -bo 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 -bo. Open. Yep, probably. And then, it, you know what? If I ever remember what this, it will be my next Twitter post. <laughs> guys, guys, this was a legendary thing. <laughs> Just like completely random. This can't be right. What the hell? How? Whatever. I'm just gonna cheese this. No, I don't think I have any like artistic thing. It's more like I know how to manipulate graphics in my favor. Which I suppose can be considered <laughs> can be considered artistic. I mean, I don't know if how much you uh, check the memes tab in Fia's Discord, but I I I made my fair contribution on that on that part. see how this goes. This should be it. If this isn't it, I'll just be satisfied with whatever we have. I mean, I'm, I've already been working like 30 minutes on this stupid color. That should be fine. Hey! That looks correct. Like, okay, sure. Could use some... Wait, that... That's literally the part I just cut out. Wow. What kind of sorcery is this? And that's literally the part I just cut out, right? Now it's like, yeah, you need that back. What? Ugh. Wake me up, wake me up inside. Can't wake up. Okay, one more attempt. Yes. I'm gonna go for that side of the right side. Which side is the right side? The left is right, okay. Not been on the memes channel that much. I have so many Discord groups I had to delete some that I was part of. Never the Fiat group has proven. Yeah, I, I know I know that feel. Like uh I also am in way too many Discord groups, and as a result, there's only like a few that you actually like actively follow, and the rest you're you just ghost in, right? Like Lurk game is strong. Or, like, I don't know how people actually, like, manage to be in 10 Discord groups at the same time. See, now that's a skill you should be envious of. So, what is your superpower? 
Yeah, I can uh, lurk in 10 Discord groups at the same time. Wow! Amazing! Amazing! Well, that's that's a um, two set file in reference, in case you were wondering. Only after dark. Mm, that looks more or less correct ish. Though I do want to get rid of the blue. Oh. Yeah, whatever. That's fixed. Easily enough. Spoop. Skip doop. Delete. Ah, shite. Oh no, actually, I can just select this, select inverse. Hey, delete groups, yes. <clears throat> Uh, let's see. Gonna probably ask for groups with like twenty. Okay. I appreciate you being here as is. Man.
And now I'm gonna make myself cry. Shit. You know what? Fuck it. Good enough. As if anyone's ever gonna be like, oh look, no 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 Whatever. Next part, Le Bouton. Do I? Yeah. Does there actually need to be anything else? Nope. So, there's one button here and one button hole, I suppose it's supposed to be. I assume it's supposed to be. But, for convenience sake, that's like 1.5, 0 0.75 is gonna be around here-ish. That's 1.5 quarter here. Halfway this. It's like 27.6. 29, that's 1.4.7. That's gonna be around here. And then somewhere around there. Uh, let's quickly Google yellow button. Seems fine enough. Whoa. That's workable size already. Doesn't Proto have like a longer list? Doesn't look like it. Eh.
Come on. There we go. Guess we'll move this line. Okay, let's see if we can round it up a bit, because at the moment it's quite rough. That looks better. Well, it doesn't necessarily look better, but it's going to blend better. And as a result, it will look better. Right. Huh? How am I gonna slick that part? select this then minus that and select the in but no Ooh, this is annoying That actually solves it. This minus this and this, and then from the blue, we move that, and we okay. There we go. We got there eventually.
Hell yeah. Next up, pouches. Or you know what? I'm gonna do the border thingy first. It's easy and fun. That's easy enough. Pockets are like whereabouts are the pockets? Like here-ish. Okay, full the shadow crease. I'm just gonna assume that he has two pockets, the reference image doesn't really specify. But it makes sense. Uh, 58, that's 42.
color and if it worked before it should work now as well uh, perhaps a bit darker It doesn't really matter that it's rougher around the edges because that's actually makes it look a bit more like fabric. So I might want to add a subtle stroke around it. Dark one, not entirely black because black is annoying to work with. Uh, where does it multiply? Come on. Multiply. There it is. Mm. Hey, unknown error VR. Welcome to the stream. I hope you're not having too much errors whilst playing VR, because that does not sound like a fun experience. Uh, but I think that's the, the jackets done. So on to the next part. Okay. As long as, well, as long as it's just the name, it's fine, right? Bowday. For the body, let's first eliminate what we don't need. What we do not need are the legs. The feet, we need the hands. We don't need the toenails. Uh, these are the toenails, right? I always mix up the toenails and the fingernails. Yep. Those can be removed, this can be removed, this can be removed. Uh, I will need this, but I don't, won't be needing this. So arms, we get those empty, so we do need the entirety of the arm. And we need the entirety of the body. This can go, this can go. Okay. Welcome to the stream, Unknown. Uh, I hope you'll be able to pick up some things. If not, well, it's always a pleasure having people around. So how has your day been? How do you make this? Uh, I use Fureit Studio. It's free software which can be downloaded from Pixiv, which is basically the Japanese equivalent of uh, Imgur. And they have like 3D software that allows you to create avatars based on templates. And by manipulating the textures you can like create your own skins. It's pretty neat software, has tons of possibilities, and it's actually fun to work with. Also glad to hear that your day is, do is going fine. always nice to hear in our current world. We 
need more positivity, right? And I hope that I can bring some positive vibes. Oksana, later I might go because of the hurricane, so if you know, if I go, okay, yeah, no, no problem, I mean, stay safe. Also, Oksana, hey, been a while since I've last heard about you. How are you doing? Like, uh, the big B day is almost around the corner, so you must be starting to feel old yet. <laughs> uh... <laughs> Yeah, two weeks is an, two weeks is an eternity. You know, you know that. <laughs> you don't need to do anything. I mean, I had. I have like one week of holidays right now and literally I barely left my bedroom so the only thing you need to do is die and that's only in the end so all other stuff is optional yep I'm creating ash it's, uh, it's fun I've spent m the majority of an hour on creating its vest, but uh, it's it's completely not like this uh, is related to anything for my next video, like completely not. It's not like my next video is gonna be me playing some um, Pokemon VR. I'm considering. Uh, I'm considering to make this the jump to Fiverr because I do think that my skill level is decent enough. But I don't know, I'm kinda kinda nervous. <laughs> uh, oh wow, so you're basically gonna nap in until you You're basically gonna meet your birthday whilst napping. That's the life. You know what, I'm gonna do the gauntlets, if it wants to load. We don't need a belly button, since we have a shirt. Do you make emotes and effects? No, I only make uh, avatars. But I don't make custom emotes nor effects, I'm sorry. I do make your avatars quest compatible though, which is a service that very few people actually provide. With certain... Li uh, no, but... Yeah, but, 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 but I, he could, I can't give him a belly button if I want to give him a... A shirt, like it's one or the other. There is no ant. And this should change nothing. Wait. Boop. Nothing has changed. Wait, why does he still have a belly button? Did I remove the belly button? Yeah. The fuck? The hack? There we go. 
He does need a shirt. <laughs> Wait, actually, let's. Uh, I believe it's this one. Oh no, that's for someone else's project. Eh, it's probably this one. Hey, it's Baka Ketchum! Yay! Whoop! Master DTD, thanks for the follow! And thanks for the follow, Unknown, as well! You make avatars for people? I. Well, so far I've made like avatars for two people. But yeah, it's not like I have any official commissions open, but I wouldn't. I'm not against doing it. Uh, yeah, I do charge. Uh, currently my prices are at, wait, what did I commission those for? Like 25, Euro, 25 euros, dollar, whatever your own currency is. If you're British, that's beneficial for me because then it's 25 pounds. But that's my current rate, which actually is super cheap. What's the price of the skins? Uh, Master DTT, I just said it, like I sell skins for 25 dollar euro your own currency well unless it's like bo bolivar sorry but i'm not gonna sell any skins for like 25 boliv bolivar because yeah obvious reasons Also, in order for me to actually start on your project, it must be a project that I, like, first off, I must <laughs> deem within my skill level. And second off, it must be something that I'm interested in, because if it doesn't interest me, if it doesn't interest me, trust me, you don't want me to make your skin. Yeah, like the average is like $25 for a skin. Depending on the work, it can be cheaper, but that's like my average price. get back to work. Okay. Yeah, sure, I'll pop by this weekend. Uh, good luck with work. Thanks for popping by. What's the green? 
something like this. No, that's too vibrant. It's gonna be something like this. However, we need to keep in mind that there's also that border thingy. Yeah. This way I can make sure that it's symmetrical. Something like this should be fine. What? make way more layers than you technically need but I like to have I like control over my over my textures and I did notice that more layers means more control it's also more work but I'll gladly take that Technically, I can just do this. Uh, what did I use for this one? Linear burn. So let's do the same for this one. There we go. And for the body, the body is going to be white out minus wait, set inverse. But no, the body is going to be the inverse of white out. Minus gloves, right? Yes. Minus those and minus gloves and minus stitching. There we go. That's going to be shirt and the shirt is something navy ish eh, slightly more green something like that Yeah, obviously not just color. Dur oh my god, imagine. Muscle ash. Let's see what we get if we use this.
Hey, it actually doesn't look bad. We do need to trim a bit down on this though. <laughs> Seems like he has an O color, which is super easy. No, it's this one. Might have to remove some of that. Do you like rap? Uh, rap's okay, like I've had my Eminem period, but this actually is Monster, uh, not Monster Cat. This actually is Protostar with some drum and bass. I don't like, I have no issues with rap. Actually, there's very little musical genres that I have issue with. That's oh, temporarily... Godzilla. Ah, shite. Uh, I forgot to turn off. Yeah, um, this is one of the streams that's gonna be on YouTube, so I can't really give you music requests. Uh, sorry. Uh, yeah, sorry, I should probably... Uh, You know what, I'll... once this one is finished I'll play it and we'll do some other stuff. Yeah, I probably should have mentioned it before. Uh... I actually forgot that I had those request things. isn't it? Ooh, not not even remotely. Unless it's more like at the point of the dark. Well, that tip actually. This thing. Well, how am I going to do this cleanly? Uh, 
I think the only actual clean way to do this is because it's wait, it's going downwards from there, right? <coughs> Boys. Okay. Twenty-four. 100 minus 24 is 80, 76. Well, I already have a marker in here, here obviously. And then we're gonna do our best to somewhat mimic the curve that we made on the other one. Something like this. Sure. Oh, okay. Minus that part. Minus whichever isn't part of the whiteout. Shit. Merge visible merge layers, not merge visible. The 3000 one. Wait, let me check. 3000 one. Um, bu bu bu. Normally I can. Can't I? Started. 3000 one. No idea. That's one that I actually didn't add. Seems like. Uh, wait. Let me quickly. For some reason it added one. Uh, how do I change those things? Ah, here we go. Uh, yeah, that's deletes. For some reason they're all in Dutch. No idea why. Uh, now it should be removed. Highlight message, unlock, random shout out. Okay. I think it should be okay now.
Come on. Actually, is it an issue that it doesn't completely connect? I mean, this one is only for personal use anyway. Sorry, Redeem also says ask if possible. No, 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 no. I just changed that to prevent uh, issues like that one. You're more than fine. There's no problem. I, I literally changed it after your request. To be fair, this one is gonna go in. Uh, I don't want to take the risk. That's the issue. Actually... See, like, this right, I really wish that the front and back, instead of fold, fold around like, like in that way, it would be way easier if it was like, folded out in that direction, because then it would just be like, oh, you want this to be a continuous texture? Okay, just mirror it. Yeah, beggars can't be choosers. Uh, the avatar itself is made using Vroid Studio, but I did make it myself, yeah. Well, uh, partially, yeah, uh, what? Oh. <laughs> okay. So uh, the avatar itself, it's made using visual using Vroid Studio. Like, let's quickly show you by opening a new instance. <coughs> so Vroid Studio, it allows you to pick a base avatar. <coughs> Wait, let me quickly drink a bit. So what, what, you can use one of these bases, and then using these you can start changing them, manipulating them, until you get whatever you want. Like from this, I currently went to this. So it's not like I made them from scratch, but I suppose I did make them technically. It's good enough. Like I said, this one's for personal use anyway, so it doesn't matter too much if it's not perfect. As long as the visual parts are there, and the visible parts do match the expectations. Yes, the ads actually go... It's because I'm a um, Twitch affiliate, so yeah, the ad revenue actually goes to me. And yeah, this avatar is for me to use, yeah. It's for uh, my next video, <coughs> perhaps, possibly, I mean, uh, on the, my YouTube channel. I hope this works, yes. Uh, it's gonna be me playing some 
Pokemon VR. Or at least reviewing it, as I don't know if I'm actually going to do a full playthrough yet. Uh, what else do, do I need to do? I kind of lost track of what I was thinking of. Uh, what was I thinking of? Right. Shirt's done, I think. Did I forget any details? Let's see. Shirt has the right color. Gloves are done. Vest is done. Pants. Pants are next. Okay. Uh, uniform pants. Wait a second. This, this looks different. Doesn't it? Nope. Export. Pants. Pants, pants, pants. For the pants, let's see. We want the belt to be brown. Maybe add a Pokeball icon here. It's gonna be 2D, but it should convey the illusion. The buckle, am I gonna care too much about the buckle? Nah. Right, it's black, so that's not gonna work. So I will need to use some of my other tricks. Right, that's too... I don't know what it is. Actually, this... Nah. Thanks for the sub. Also, I'm gonna change my default uniform because black pants are annoying to work with. Instead, I am gonna be using... Wait, aren't there supposed to be like other... Oh, crud. Clothing. Uh, there we go. That's gonna work e better. That's gonna be easier to work with. Nope. Yes, replace. 
pants. Here we go. Way easier. Is it me or is there a slight red hue to it? Must be me. Staring at the screen for too long. Mm, so these things are gonna be blue as well. It's literally the belts that I need. Let's start getting. Let's start selecting stuff. Easiest way probably is gonna be to select the entire bar and then start unselecting stuff afterwards. Don't work hard don't work hard, work smart. There we go. Boop. Ski doop. And that's our belt, which is something we'll look back at in just a moment. First, I'm gonna select everything else. Yeah, everything else should be fine. Pants. Boom. The belt is gonna have a brownish color, therefore we go to orange. Sure. This actually looks rather well. Wow. That was easy. I might want to do something more fancy with that though. Like I assume it's some kind of metal clip. So let's give it one of my custom gradients, which we're gonna mirror. Babylon the Moss with a chisel soft, I believe it was. And this gives it a nice metallic look. Next up the pants, there's some jeans type stuff. So that's gonna be 
something like not that. Something like this ish. I'm gonna zoom out a bit though. Do you know who Great Moon Aroma is? Great Moon Aroma. No, I do not know who Great Moon Aroma is. Actually, I'm actually not into the VR set that long, but it does look like a fun... Oh damn, they're even on the VR chat Legends wiki. Uh, let's see. Memer alongside Lolothon, which I do know who it is. Uh, they aren't... Doing a major meme, he sometimes describes Korean Lolothon. Okay. Yeah, like, I made a top 10 video with, like, people I knew because, like, I noticed that there wasn't really any, like, lists. Like, I actually googled, before making that video, I actually googled, like, for a list because I was interested to be like, okay, what are, like, YouTubers other people look at and I couldn't really find any real listings so I was like okay you know what that's something I am gonna do and as a result well that video came out I think like even though it's not on the list I think my list is a decent one in order to get started with VR at least <laughs> I might look I might do an update but it's not gonna be immediate otherwise it's like I don't want to milk content, you know? Because otherwise I could... <laughs> every week a new top 10. Top 10 of this week! obviously be to one day be in a top 10 list for myself. see what this looks like uh, yeah, uh, you should also look at B I know Bipu I do know Bipu but the thing is I literally discovered Bipu the day after <laughs> my kindred list because trust me she would be in there like seventh seventh place probably reason being Bipu I like the content but it's a bit too hyperactive at times for me Yeah, trust me, like, there's a lot of new... Like, chill. Yeah. Like, like, trust me, like, uh, literally, after I made that video, I discovered a lot of actually amazing <laughs> VTubers. But that's because after making that video, I finally started getting into the Twitch community. Uh, not the Twitter community, I mean, 
Also, like, I think Rebel also isn't on... No. Oh, right. I... You know what? I think I have a way. Uh, because Beepu mostly focuses on Twitch, right? But that's... But that list is for YouTubers. Ah. Catching my drift. Catching my drift. Uh, do I need anything else on the pants? I think I got majority of the details. Like, there isn't really any details on the pants. It's just a jeans pants with a brown belt. I'm gonna darken the pants a bit. I'm not entirely a fan of the color. It's like less ash, but I don't know, I think it looks, it matches better. Next up the shoes. So he would pull out his gym badges. Oh right, I was gonna add a Pokeball, wasn't I? Thanks for remembering me of details. Pokeball. How many Pokeballs are we going to give him? That's the question though. Three? That sounds like a decent number, yeah. Be on the belt right 
Wait, let me quickly double check which side is right, right? I think it's this one. Uh, oh, shit. Right, this is the front. This is the front. On his right. Wait, don't, don't I have... Is he has him on both sides on the reference image. Like, there's some on the left. Wait, can I... Point. <coughs> See, like, there's some here, but there's also some here. Yeah, I, kn I know they're on the belt, but I don't want I want to have them, like, hanging on the bottom of the belt, not on top of the belt. <coughs> uh, let's see. So it's going to be somewhere in that part, here-ish. Okay, three balls there. Yoink. Wait, where did I say? Actually, to be entirely fair, I think I'm... Oh, not like that. Only this one. I might as well... Actually, I think he, he has it more like this. Like two on each side, like... Yeah, like one here. I think he has them like symmetrical on both sides. So if I want to do four balls, that would be something like this. Eh, let's go four. Yes, okay. Half of these you won't be able to see anyway, so it's not like it matters too much. So like the only way you can see them is actually if you go up close and... Ugh. You'd have to get up very up close in order to see them. But they're there, which is a nice detail in itself. Uh, okay, pants done. Okay. Saved. Next up are the shoes, the iconic sneakers. So instead of loafers, we're gonna go sneakers. Are they sneakers? Or are they... <laughs> pumps! Yes, Asian pumps! <laughs> uh, sneakers, right? That seems to be the more appropriate shoe. Perhaps basketball shoes? Basketball shoes would fit as well. Alright, I might have to add the white border here. Sneakers. Let's go sneakers. They are fun to edit. Oh, 
Okay, for the sneakers, what's the important details? Because I am actually going to sketch these out. So we need this part to be like to come up a bit. Mm, it's just green. We need this part to come up a bit. Why can't I draw? Hello. Yeah. This not that much though. With this part to come up a tiny bit. Like so. Then we need two big lines. Not that wide. Then we need two lines which go like something like this. Then over here we need something like this. And then we need a circle here. I think that's decent. No, it's like more here-ish. That's gonna be no. What the hell? There. Something like this is a decent sketch, right? I think. Uh, let's see, do, am I forgetting anything at that point? Nope. I think I have everything on the shoes. Okay. Export. Shoe guide. Uh, shoe guides, here we go. <coughs> okay. Hey, Domino! Welcome to chat, welcome to the stream. We are currently working on Ash's shoes. Sounds like fun. It actually kind of is fun. I'll quickly show you what we've got so far. With, with me it's going pretty well. With the model it's also going pretty well as you can see. I hope you're doing well as well. Fine as well. Well as well. What well? What? Mm. Words. I'm always curious how people actually like find my channel. But yeah. So guys, how did you find the channel? Might as well ask directly, right? 
in the VR chat section. Huh, okay. Anything else interesting going on in the VR chat section or is it pretty calm evening today. I actually haven't checked myself yet. Has the amount of, um, what's it called, devouring streams already lowered? <laughs> because that definitely was a hype for some period of time. Next, next ish. This, this thing. Don't really know. Okay, fair enough. Can't expect you guys to know to be omniscient. Om omniscient, yeah. Omniscient is a word, right? Yeah. Yes, it is. Thanks for the follow, Domino No. Hi Pu, hi Pu. I would do something with my arms if three teen actually tracked arms. Just know it says 4 a.m. No problem. Uh, yeah. Thanks for popping by anyway, and uh, hope you're having a good night rest. See ya. Lines, right? Whoop, 
That was a trick I forgot it some time ago. <sighs> oh, merge layers. the same for this right And copy layer, paste, and then the entirety of the shoe is gonna be blue. Oh yeah, aside from this area, obviously. Connected. No. <laughs> I did not think this true, did I? Shit. Why am I even doing it this way? I can do this way smarter. Well, sometimes you just don't do the smart things. The smart is efficient and efficient can be boring. Minus this. Oh, wrong stripes. Minus this, minus this, minus this, minus this, and minus this, minus this. Okay. Uh, yeah. Blue. Light should be fine. Uh, 
But let's try out some other stuff. Ooh. Pivot light's nice. This one with a darken on it. Darken. Yo! This looks sick. Sick umbrella, bro. Sure, I need to change the, like the the pants a bit, but still. Uh, it's supposed to be like this, isn't it? Uh, works fine. All right, I have to remove the shoelaces. Which I don't mind at all because I hate those default textures anyway. Boop. Point G. Yes, replace. Okay. There we go. Damn, son. Look at those. They look sweet. I think this is recognizable as Ash, right? I could create a cap, but I, well, I can't, like I'm not good enough at <laughs> p right yet for that. Still not entirely convinced on that part, but it is what it is. Uh, So yeah, let's finish up the pants, and then I think that's gonna be it. Open a pants. Mm, it's gonna be somewhere around here-ish. <sighs> Wait, why am I doing this on the image? No. Open. And there we go. the name is and that's just gonna be a slightly grayish of course we need to fill it in first Yeah. 
that should be all. Save as. PNG. Hands. Save. Yes. It might look a bit weird on the edges. But we'll see that in just a moment. Let's re import the new pants. Yo, sick umbrella, bro. But on that note, I think we have actually finished it. Thanks for watching, guys. It's been a pleasure having you here. See ya in the next one.